how do you give your robots like Sophia and Professor Einstein such a realistic look? Well, we have skin material that simulates facial expression. This was part of my graduate work, and we brought it to mass manufacturing thanks to a variety of breakthroughs as well. Then behind the skin, we have a bunch of motors that are simulating the muscle actions of the human face and neck muscles. We then have to power it to interact with people. So you have to process the human face understand the situational context, see human facial expressions, and then respond to that. Could you introduce us to your newest robotic invention? Uh, sure, yeah. I think I'd like the professor to introduce himself, if he will. Hey, okay. professor, why don't you tell us about yourself? I'm Professor Einstein, your personal genius. I'm the playful robot that teaches science and plays brain games to make you smarter. <laughs>